want to we want to make sure that all the leaks were identified so we wouldn't patch up the wall and then there's, there's, there, there'd be some more leaks. So we've had several people come out and look at the property. I'm not sure exactly how many bids we got. Imam Farouk or, uh, can update you on that. But we've got several bids on repairing it. So inshallah, we'll get it repaired back up. We'll get the walls patched back up. So um, we'll remove the plastic. And all of the mold has already been remediated. So there's nothing in the air. And they've already sprayed fungicide in the back. And this killed all the um, mold. So inshallah, we shouldn't have any more issues with that. We had the money in our rainy day fund to pay for everything. But the thing about a rainy day fund is once you deplete it, you got to build it back up because the rain's going to come back, especially in Houston. <laughs> so on your way out, make a contribution to the repairs. Um, and so that we can replenish our rainy day fund so that when this happens again, we don't have to come out and ask okay, we need to get this fixed, so donate now. We will have the money by planning ahead. So inshallah, on your way out, just make a contribution, $500,000, $5,000, whatever. Yes. I'm not asking you to make a $10 donation. You know how we do it here. We can raise $30,000 right after Juma, and we have before, and you know that. And whatever is not used for the repairs will go to Ibrahim Kamal Din Community Center, which... I think we ordered the topographic survey. I think we ordered the soil sampling. Uh, the plans are being finished very soon. Now we can do it because we have the money. We're going to put the coming soon. See, I didn't want to put it two years ago because you drive on the parking lot and say, man, is, is it still coming? Is it still coming? We're close enough now. We have, we have enough funds now to get a significant amount of work done. We're gonna, and, we're, and we're getting the finalized plans. So inshallah, I'm telling you, Man Farouk and, and, and Ahmed Shaheed, it's time now. Let's put up the coming soon Ibrahim Kamaluddin Community Center, inshallah. So, Allahu Akbar. So, so whatever you give toward the repairs that we don't need to use toward the repairs or replenishing our rainy day fund will go right back into the Ibrahim Kamaluddin Community Center fund. And inshallah, as, as soon as the plans are finished, stamped, and they work their way through the city, we will break ground. And we're not talking about uh, Ba'ada. We're not talking about a long way, right? Ba'id, right? We're not talking about a long way away. We're talking about Salfa, Salfa in the, in, in, in the near future. Uh, 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 you know, when I say Salfa, uh, Salfa means the near future, but it's still a little delayed. If I say say ya alamun, it means the immediate, right? So, so if it's sat, it depends on how quickly the city approves it, right? But, but regardless, in inshallah, it's salfa, and it's not ba'id. So make dua for, 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 for the community. Make dua for all those who are suffering. Everyone around the world who's suffering today, oh Allah, please uh, remove the suffering from them. For those who are under the hand of oppressors, O oh Allah, please remove the hands of the oppressors from them. O oh Allah, we cannot manage this life alone without you. Please make of our life what you want it to be, what you prefer it to be. Do not allow us to act on our own. Please make us act in accordance with your will. Bless us to act in accordance with your, your will. We hear and we obey. We seek your forgiveness. We turn to you in repentance. Walhamdulillahi Rabbil Alameen. Ameen. Aqeem as Allah <laughs> Make your lines even and straight. Line up shoulder to shoulder, heart to heart. Allahu Akbar.
Alhamdulillahi Rabbil Alameen Ar-Rahman Ar-Rahim Malik Yawm Al-Din Iyaka Na'budu wa Iyaka Nasta'in Ihdina Sirat Al-Mustaqim Sirat Al-Ladhina An'amta Alayhim غير المغضوب عليهم ولا الضالين ألم نشرح لك صدرك ووضعنا أنك وزرك الذي أنقض ظهرك ورفعنا لك ذكرك فإن مع العسر يسرا إن مع العسر يسرا فإذا فرغت فانصب وإلى ربك فارغب الله أكبر يا الله لمن حمده الله أكبر الله أكبر الله أكبر الله أكبر الحمد لله رب العالمين الرحمن الرحيم مالك يوم الدين إياك نعبد وإياك نستعين إهدينا الصراط المستقيم صراط الذين أنعمت عليهم غير المغضوب عليهم ولا الضالين قل أعوذ برب الناس ملك الناس إله الناس من شر الوسواس الخناس الذي يوسوس في صدور الناس من الجنة والناس الله أكبر سمع الله لمن حمده الله أكبر الله أكبر الله أكبر الله أكبر
Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi Assalamu alaikum. Minister Dr. Okay. Yes, we have uh, so many guests out here today. We also have Minister Robert Muhammad, Minister Dr. Robert Muhammad, excuse me. And uh, <laughs> uh, ma'am, uh, uh, Minister Eric as well. I uh, just have a few brief announcements. Uh, first and foremost, we will be having, uh, please give generously to the cat, Sautica, and the building fund. Uh, please patronize the uh, food next door. Do we have food next door? That's the one thing I didn't have. Huh? Yes. All right. For the low, low price of $10, you get an amazing meal uh, cooked by believers who believe. Uh, and it's halal and it's scrumptious. So please make sure you go there and uh, partake of it. Uh, we have the Camp Khalil Bolathon coming up on November 11th. That night, we also have Masjid Talim Muhammad's fundraiser. So please, you can get your tickets here at the Masjid. Just see Imam Farouk. Uh, the Master Talim is also doing a culture night that's free uh, admission on November 9th, uh, 10th, if you want to partake in that. Uh, congratulations to uh, Dr. Rashida Farouk on successfully defending her d uh, dissertation uh, at Texas A&M University. Um, uh, please make du'a for Sister Medina Green, uh, who is having health challenges, so let's uh, pray that Allah grant her a speedy recovery from what ails her. And, um, I think we also have the uh, sisters uh, led Talim coming up next Sunday. And the uh, Sunday after that, inshallah, we'll have our hajis doing the Talim. Uh, that'll be November 5th. Uh, so our three hajis from the Masjid will be uh, sharing their reflections uh, the first Sunday in November. And the last Sunday in November, we'll be having our sisters leading the Talim. And their topic is going to be uh, mutual rights. They're going to start a new series on, uh, I believe, this this series will be on the rights between Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and the humanity. Uh, so that'll be the first of the mutual rights series that they intend to present from the sister's perspective. So please, we want everybody to come out and participate in that. We'll have uh, Talim this Sunday as well. Uh, weekend school will be open this Sunday as well for all of our, our youth from, uh, thank you, uh, 17. Under uh, <laughs> from 10 to 1 o'clock, and please uh, uh, buy your Muslim journal. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Assalamu alaikum. Real quick, I just want to give you the menu because if I don't give you the menu, then they may not let me eat. We have cornbread uh, dressing stuffed halal chicken or cornbread dressing stuffed whiting fillets, southern style mixed greens, which consist of collards and mustard greens, candied carrots, wheat rolls, iced tea, punch, and bottled water, all for the low price of. $10. Don't forget to go uh, next door and patronize our vendors. Uh, Malik has some special art that he's selling, so uh, please uh, patronize the vendors. Assalamu alaikum.